everybody, what up? It's Professor Dovahkeen again, and welcome to AP Skyrim. I uh, haven't uploaded a video in a while. Um, I realize that there are some of you who, uh, if it's ever happened to you where you get, where two dragons all of a sudden appear and you have no idea what to do, you're just, you're just scared poopless. So what I'm going to do here uh, is, because I've got a PC version, I can spawn dragons uh, from opening up this thing here. Um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you how to manage two dragons at one time and eventually defeat them. Um, what I, what you, first what you're going to need is you're going to need a pretty good character. Um, you're not going to want to try and fight dragons, dual wheel dragons using iron, uh, like, like banded iron, even iron, even iron or even banded iron armor, uh, or even steel, real good steel. You won't be able to do it very well. Um, I would recommend, uh, I mean, obviously if you're light armor, you can run around real fast, but you're not going to be able to tank dragons real well. Um, if you have steel plate, that should do it. But uh, man, Orcish Armor is where it's at. Uh, is really the the solid names uh, as far as um, it's really the solid point where you can dual dual uh, take on dragons, uh, two of them. Second thing you're gonna need, you're gonna need uh, your weapon. You're gonna need uh, probably not a bow. I would I uh, just safe close quarters. Um, shields are always really helpful. I, I always stress how good blocking is. Cause if you don't block, you're dead. You're an idiot. I don't know what you're thinking. If you're not blocking, you're just juggernauting everything. Um, second, what you're gonna third, what you're gonna need? Oh, look at this joke. Yeah, get out of here. That's right. Run on your tail. Um, what you're gonna need second of all is you are going to need uh, a flat area. So like somewhere where you can um just kind of just kind of run around and try and evade dragons. Now you're gonna want a little bit of cover. So this right here isn't exactly a good area. We're gonna run up kind of up here. To where there's some rocks, um, and then we're gonna spawn these dragons. Um, you're gonna want to make sure that you can uh, get behind something and crouch. That way, if the dragons want to fight you. Also, there's that mammoth over there. Those are always good because then the mammoths will kind of occupy the dragons. That's always good if you can get other NPCs in the area. Uh, you can see white ones right over there. The dragon right over there. There's just a bunch of cover here, and that's what you're gonna need eventually. You're gonna need some sort of cover. Um, so let me show you the shouts you're gonna need. You're gonna oh my god. Okay, here are you all my shouts and all your different stuff. Dragon Rend, you're not gonna. Uh, you can use Dragon Rend a little bit, but uh, I mean, for one dragon, it's essential. When you've got two, you got to focus on dealing damage. That's what you've got to do. Um, Call Dragon uh, Odvaying, you're not gonna want to use him because his shout takes a long, long time. Storm Call is really good, but um, I've only got a couple words of it unlocked. I'm not sure exactly where you get that. Um, if you want to know, I can uh, see how much storm. I, yeah, I only have one word. So really, um, that's what other shouts I've got. I don't really have a whole lot of good shouts here. So really, what you're gonna want to do is you've gotta you've gotta use your. Uh, I mean, I would, I might use storm call just for this one, just because. Um, it's so essential at bringing down multiple. It's a, the best crowd control. Um, it's the best crowd control um, shout around, I think. And on my other character, I've got all of it ready. Um, so let's let's go ahead and spawn the dragons. And I'm going to show you, just kind of watch me what I do. And uh, just kind of watch. And, um, and I'll go back. And I'll kind of watch what I'm doing. And I'll go back and if you need something. And I'll kind of explain things. So let's go ahead and spawn these dragons. Um, let's go ahead and get a blood dragon up. Uh, the most common combination is an as a frost dragon and a um, uh, frost dragon and a blood dragon. So we're gonna go ahead and go frost drag. Fast frog stops for ten moments. Sweetie bee. See what I gotta do here. Hmm. Let's see. How do I? Dang it! What do I do here? Let's try player dot dt. Maybe I just. Okay, let's try this then. Player dot D A T 
equals red. Batch file can be found. Well, that's that's unfortunate. Um, give me just a second here, guys. I'm having I'm having problems here. Hey guys, I'm back. Um, sorry, I had the wrong codes open here. Let me take a look at this. Uh, even the best professors make mistakes, I guess. All right, so here's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna open this up. Player dot place at me. Um, F seven seven F eight, and that is gonna. Yep, there we go. Here, there's our blood dragon. There's our blood dragon. Now let's get him up in the air. Now let's get a ice, a frost dragon up in the air somewhere. Um, obviously what you're going to want to do, you're going to focus on the, uh, you're going to focus on the frost dragon first. And obviously if there are two, um, there are two blood dragons, you're not going to need to worry about it too much. Um, so, all right, there's our frost dragon. Now let's drop our uh, storm call shout. There, that's gonna drop our. Now let's find our frost dragon. See where he's at. Now let's kind of wait for. Th oh man, I shouldn't. Let's kind of get uh, some cover here. It's gonna take deal some damage on him. Now let's kind of just get him up near. All right, so this bullet dragon's just landed, and we're just gonna have to take care of him while we can. Oh, get, get, my, you're gonna want to get behind your false dragon, your blood dragon, so that the false dragon can't deal with you. All right, he's back up in the air, so now let's look for our frost dragon. Where's he at? Oh, there he is. Get some. We're taking some cover here, and now this blood dragon's back from blood. Uh, now, it also depends on which dragon is just chewing at you the most. So this blood dragon is just, you know, see, he's gone. So we're, we're just pretty set on. How am I still taking damage? I don't understand that. All right, loot, of course, loot the dragon. Let's go ahead and get our frost dragon wherever he's at. So you see, here he is, and he's not one to land. So that's why I say that uh, dragon Ran's good. Here he comes. Here he goes. All right, there we go. The frost dragons are obviously the creator of two evils. Also, uh, if you've been noticing, let me show you something here. Um, this is always important to keep your stamina up. Because if you're not keeping your stamina up, you can't uh, do what I like to do, which is uh, make sure is interrupt the dragon's uh, shouts. So that's always important when you can interrupt his shouts. So here he comes. Now watch what I'm about to do. Let's wait until he's about to drop his shout here. See now that interrupts his shout when I kind of shield at him. Oh, he thought you were gonna shout there, didn't you? Nope, lol. Make sure you're blocking too. That's very important. Should now is now when you get down to one, it's kind of important that you keep dragon rend up. I don't like to use my fire brush shout for dragons just because um if the recharge is so long. Um, I guess. You block up, keep. Oh wow, he just tried to pick me up, little punk. What's he doing over there? What's he doing over here? Who? What's he got over here? A random white run guard. Is that a random white white run guard over here? That's embarrassing. Just chew him out. Just hit him as hard as you can. Many times again. Make sure you're blocking. It's always important. Well, I thought he was going to shout there. I guess he decided not to. It's just I'm kind of striking a couple times in the morning. There we go. All right. And again, that's kind of just that's just kind of how you do it. Still pray. Ooh, that's a good. I'm going to take those. Take those like a boss. Again, that's just kind of how you do it. You just got to kind of make sure that the dragons are not going to take control. Just kind of manhandle them. Um, but at the same time, you can't. Um, don't don't try and just straight tank it. Make sure you're blocking. Make sure you. Uh, 
make sure you're kind of managing both of them because if you just focus on one or if you like if you focus on one or if you evenly split you've got to kind of focus on one while keeping your eye on the other you can't just ignore the other one um get the helm off here the battle's over um yeah that's about it um that's that's just about really all there is to uh that um i think obviously i'm gonna have to i'll you gotta make sure storm calls good um but then again remember that the more you uh what is going on the more that i'm having a lagasm the more that you um the more that you um the more the more words you have for the shot the longer it'll take to recharge i believe so just make sure that you uh, keep that in mind and you know again if you just want to use um Again, if you just want to use uh, Dragon Ren, that's fine too. Um, actually, I wonder if I should just show you what that's like now that my shout is recharged. Um, you know what? What the crap? Let's do it. Um, this time I'm going to use uh, just just Dragon Ren, uh, just because just because some of you might not have Storm Call, but if you've beaten the game and you have a Workish Armor, you should have a uh, Dragon Ren because you get that with the main quest. So let's do that again. Uh, only this time. Let's do, uh, no, let's just keep it at two Frost Dragons, actually. Um, okay, but, let me, because you know, you're not all, on, I don't think all of you will have, um, we'll take at least, see. Oh, there's our second. There's our. Let's see. First, worry about face. Let me. F seven seven. All right, and there's our blood dragon. All right, now let me show you here. Um, what you're wanna. Oh, oh my gosh, what is happening? Obviously, what you're gonna wanna do is you're gonna get your uh, dragon run shout out. And I'm gonna put my helmet on, like a good boy. Using uh kind of now always like call your shots kind of aim ahead. Dang it, I missed. Well, you keep your eyes on both of them. Make sure, like I said, uh, that's a pretty. Oh, here we go. Drop it. Also, Dragon Run will also. Dragon Run also. Also interrupts um. Dragon Ren will interrupt um, shout, their shouts too. And again, the great thing is you can just keep them on the ground as long as you like. Now I'll keep him on the ground. That's always a good tool with Dragon Ren is that you can keep them both on the ground. So you can keep one on the ground and then move over here to the other one. See, I'm kind of, I'm kind of getting my health down here, but it's because I'm not blocking. All oh, the guard ran inside the room. That's good. Did I just level up? 